Does it ever feel like your child is speaking another language? Not sure why they started referring to you as bruh? If so, you've come to the right place. I'm Adina Kalish, Director of Media Relations at Bark, a parental controls company. Our team of experts has compiled a list of the top 10 teen slang every parent needs to know about. Part 1. Why Kids Love Slang Every generation of young people develops its own slang, and they do so because it helps teens form their own identities and express independence. Kids today don't want to use the phrases we did in the 90s. Can you imagine a Gen Z child saying all that in a bag of chips? We've compiled 10 of the most important slang terms parents need to know about in 2022. We'll define them and then give an example of how they'd be used in an actual kid's conversation. Let's jump in. Number one, plug. Plug is used to refer to someone who can connect you with drugs or drug dealer. Sometimes you'll just see the plug emoji. Example, did you text your plug about grabbing some stuff before the party tonight? Number two, Smash. This verb means to have casual sex, kind of like to hook up. Example, look at Taylor, would you smash? Three, body count. Refers to the number of people someone has slept with. Example, I'm a virgin, so my body count is zero. Number four, cringe. Something that causes feelings of embarrassment or awkwardness. In other words, this gets used a lot by teens. It may also be used as an adjective, as in cringy. Example, mom, stop trying to do a TikTok dance, it's so cringe. Five, fit. Fit is short for outfit. It's commonly paired with check to make the phrase fit check, which means check out my outfit. Example, fit check, what I'm wearing on the first day of school. Number six, gas can refer to marijuana or can be used to describe something that's cool. It can also be used as a verb to mean hype someone up. Example, I know I look good today, gas me up. Number seven, I-Y-K-Y-K. -Y -Y if you know, you know, meant to imply that there's an inside joke. Example, posting a photo of a favorite meal with a weird dipping sauce with I-Y-K-Y-K -Y -K in the caption. Number eight, thick. Having a strong or curvy body comes from a variation of thick. Example, Oliver works out, he's thick. Number nine, cap. A cap is a lie. It's commonly used in the negative form, no cap, which means no lie or it's true. Example, no cap school is literally canceled tomorrow. Number 10, drip, style. Great fashion sense, flashy accessories. Example, Take a look at my drip today, dude. We hope this video has helped you learn a little more about the way teens talk today. If you'd like to learn more, the Bark blog has several posts about common slang terms and emojis. Just visit bark.us slash blog and type in slang to the search bar. Did you know that Bark can also help keep your kids safe when they're using slang? Our award-winning parental control tool keeps up with the newest teen terms and can alert you if your kid is using or viewing them especially if they're words you'd never be able to decipher otherwise. You'll get an alert so you can check in and make sure everything is okay. Visit www.bark.us to learn more and start your free one-week trial.